So Jeff went into the room and never hit the ground. Oh, man. Well, that's a pretty good one there, Paul. But uh, I got one that's even better. Don't give me brown old. trousers, man. I'm telling you, this is scary. Once, there was this man called the Old Gipper, and he was a caretaker at a cemetery. Until one time, he could not take it anymore. And he, with his distinctly red shoes, butchered his entire family in a funeral procession, waiting to bury their beloved. And now, every night at 9 o'clock, he waits in the cemetery, and waits, and waits, for one victim to come and catch a glimpse of his red shoes, so he may chop their heads off. So where is this cemetery at? Well, it's up, it's up the hill, you know, there's, there's, there's the hill there, and then you go into the cemetery, it's hard to miss the cemetery. Right in the middle of the cemetery, that's where he is, right by the big oak tree. Baloney, Joseph. That's the most lotus crap I've ever heard. Oh, dude, I bet you you couldn't even last an hour there waiting in the cemetery for old Mr. Gipper. How much do you want to bet? I'll bet you a hundred bucks, bucko. You don't even have a hundred bucks. Oh, you want to see it? Fine, a hundred bucks to stay one hour in the cemetery? Morgan, you're going to get too scared to leave. Are we on? A hundred bucks? bucks, you're on. Okay, you guys are witnesses. Let's I see, see it. This looks like a place. Well, here's the spot. Man, this is gonna be the easiest hundred bucks I ever made. Oh, well, they said an hour. This is about an hour before he shows up. I'm just gonna set my alarm. Man, hour went by already? This was so easy. Joseph wasting my time. Don't kill me, please. You dropped your wallet. <laughs> 